In this video, I'll be answering a viewer's question as to whether we're close to a cure for multiple sclerosis. To hear my answer, don't turn away, because that starts right now. Howdy! Thanks for learning about MS with me, Aaron Boster. I started this YouTube channel to help my own MS clinic patients learn between visits, and it's my hope that through these videos, I can help you learn too. Today, I'll be answering another viewer's question, this time written by Verna Halloran. She writes, so many treatments and new therapies. Is there even so much as a rumor if a cure is in the pipes? Verna, that's an excellent question. And here's my answer. No. In 2019, I do not think that we are within striking distance of a cure for multiple sclerosis. And I want to explain why. We have come a really long way in our understanding of the disease process. We have a better understanding of how to use neurodiagnostics, and we have more options than ever before to treat this condition. And yet, there are fundamental questions about what causes MS and how we can impact that that remain unanswered. Realistically speaking, I don't think that within my career, we will have a cure for multiple sclerosis. But let's be honest. We don't cure most things in medicine. Barring a cancer that can be cut out of someone's body, which could be considered a cure, most conditions are treated. We don't cure diabetes, we treat it. And I want to use diabetes as an example because it is my opinion that within my lifetime, we can make MS boring like well-controlled diabetes. Allow me to explain. In the ancient days of yesteryear, actually not that long ago at all, Diabetes was a death sentence. People who developed diabetes would ultimately lose their kidneys and go into renal failure and pass away. You may not even know that your friend has diabetes unless you happen to be eating chocolate cake and they pull out a little pen and inject themselves and you say, what are you doing? And they say, oh, I'm giving myself my insulin. In the modern era, well-controlled diabetes isn't easy. It takes a lot of work, both from the practitioner and most certainly from the pe person impacted by diabetes. But done right, and with maybe a touch of luck, it can be boring, meaning you can live a normal life expectancy and a normal life quality having the autoimmune condition diabetes. It is my belief that we are rapidly moving towards a state where we can achieve the same thing in multiple sclerosis. And in fact, with the early application of the most effective medicines, with attention to brain health, paying attention to diet, to exercise, to avoiding tobacco, etc., the prospects for newly diagnosed patients are better than ever before that we can make the disease boring. There you have it, Verna, my two cents. I don't think that we're gonna see a cure in the next 20 some years, but I do think increasingly well-controlled MS will be described as boring. Once again, my name's Aaron Boster, and thank you for learning about MS with me. I would love to hear your comments and questions, and I so appreciate it when you guys write in. I look forward to reading them and to responding. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel, it would make me feel awesome if you would do so. Please consider clicking the little red button. Until my next video or until my next live stream, this is Aaron Boster saying take care.